Hello Aquarius, I'm Susie from The Gift Hero 2 and I'm here to read your cards for the next seven days and ask the universe what they'd like you to know. So Aquarius, 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 universe for Aquarius, next seven days is March 22nd for Aquarius, Aquarius, March 22nd, just for Aquarius. Guys, tell me Aquarius for the next seven days, tell me Aquarius. Well, they're all out, I think. Three, four, five, six, seven. One more for Aquarius, please. Angels, the spirit guides Aquarius. Aquarius, what would you like Aquarius to know? Angel spirit guides, what would you like Aquarius to know? What would you like Aquarius to know? Okay, so Aquarius, Queen of Swords, it's your element of air. Okay, so you're concentrating on this money someone's given you money quite I've got three signs so far have got this money there might have been money offered to like a large sum of money like an inheritance or a win uh, you're cold to the warmth of relationship but there's a security of a home okay uh someone's been offering you charity but it's causing you an overwhelm. So this Queen of Swords is your energy. So you're thrown out, you're very cold, you're you're focused, you're seeing the truth. There's the inheritance on top of here, a larger sum of money, but it drops to the Six of Pentacles where someone's maybe begging you for some of this money or they want their share of this inheritance. So it's causing you a lot of worry that you maybe you've got this money or you've spent some of it and now someone wants it back, right? So this is unnecessary worry. This is you making up things in your head, okay? Um, there's this page of swords here who's a gossip, a hindrance in any undertaking. There's a spy. So someone's gossiping um, and there's this fight. There's this, oh, this battle of wills. You're guarding your heart. You're up on a platform and you're fighting for your position. Could mean in a job. Um, people want what you've got. Someone's jealous and they're causing this fight. Um, you've got the Hierophant here, which is someone who's coming to give you a message of which way to go, what to do. It could be like an institution, like a college or uh, a priest in a church. It could mean a commitment of marriage. Um, It's it's knowledge. You, you you while you're up on this platform, you get this higher knowledge of something. It's like you've got the scroll. You know what you're doing. You're committed to something, and they want it. This Knight of Swords again is a Gemini energy. It rushes in. Who has your back, Aquarius? And they want to help you. But if they want to help you fight. They want to help you fight something, or they want to help you. Um, discuss something right again there's this seven of pentacles which is this energy of should I stay should I go with this should I stay with this person with this house and this cow because I've got a bit of money now and if I gamble it I might get more money or there might be other stuff out there that I need to um, find out about I need to travel I need to do stuff you know I don't want to stay in this house I want to go and, and and take my chances on a gamble and she's saying please don't go you want I want you to stay because we've got a house and we've got a cow and everything and uh so it's you're at a crossroads at the end of this week thinking well what do I invest in what part of love do I take down into the ether and make work what do I actually really want um, I've got to make, I'm the magician, I can make any one of these roads work. If anything you choose to do, you're able to make it a success. So I wouldn't worry about it. It's just, the worry is just the choice of what to do. Um, someone could be blowing hot air, lying about some stuff with this Seven of Cups, um, offering things that they can't give. So you've, you're at this, tr this crossroad of which way to go. Um... And where to invest your energy. These two sevens surround you as this magician. So. You can make any one of these things that says. His arms go up or down. 
I think he's actually an Aquarius card. I always say you're Aries, but I think he's Aquarius. So this is you. You can do anything you want at the end of this week. You've just got to decide what you want and is it worth it? Where do you invest this money? So it goes from the 10 to the 6 to the 7. So you build it back up to the 7, but this time you don't want to let it go because it's like you've let it go for this person. You've let this money go, this inheritance or this savings, or and this caused you overwhelm because someone was jealous of you. You're trying to battle this fight. Someone said something and you're fighting to battle and guard your heart or keep this job or um, keep this status quo in this institution. It could be within a marriage. Um, but some someone's coming in like a twin brother or someone like a Gemini is on the back of this horse and he's got your back and he wants to fight for your corner and say, come on, let's go, or the, the, the start of war. So that enables you to think, oh, my, what do I do? I, I want to go and I've got back up to the seven of coins. I want to go and invest in some kind of something. So what road do I choose? What one of these cups do I pull down from the ether? Do you want to get married? Do you want to live on your own? Do you want to live with this person? She's praying here to Aphrodite saying, please bring him back because I'll, I'll do it differently this time. But Aphrodite is saying, well, you need to bring something down. You need to work something out. You need to choose a path and stick to it. You can't just hedge your bets all the time because it's upsetting. I've got the three of pentacles, Aquarius, on the bottom of the deck. So there's going to be a promotion within a team. So you're going to be able to um, expand, I think, where you are, where you're the manager and other people are, are working for you. So you might be given a promotion at work and that will help the decision. Um, you're just seeing other things. Where's my romance angels? Okay, romance angel cards. What would you like, Aquarius, to know? Children, your love life is being affected by children. Okay, so maybe it's not sexy anymore. Because really, the only love up there is these cups up here. And it's, it's a decision of what, where to go with love, right? But around here, it's all about money, security, um, worry, trying to keep your platform with your passionate God in your heart. Commitment to maybe whether the Knight of Swords is going to come in and or help you, or you're going to stay with this Knight of Swords. But they are on a moving horse again. But they have got your back. But they need they might run in and out also. They're chatty, chat, 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 chat. There's a lot of talk going on about a commitment, but maybe you don't want that commitment. You want to take a different path, and you're not sure who you want to love or what you want to do. So maybe you just go and get the promotion instead and think, all right, I'll just stick to, to the coin, I'll stick to the security. But children could be affecting this, this situation. What would the angels and spirit just like Aquarius to know for the next seven days? Next seven days for Aquarius. But be careful if you've got this money, who you share it with or who you tell about it, because it might be overwhelming, it might be a worry. Or maybe you you need to pay off this money to someone or you've spent some of it. There's a worry over money, I know that. And, and keeping your job. <clears throat> Keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from your usual type and expectations. Love yourself first. Your self-respect makes you more romantically attractive. To be wise, you're, you're, this Hierophant, this is like a Taurus, they're very stable, but they want to show, you, you know what the quest is. You know your God-given talent. You, you've got the knowledge here to... to take a path and make it a success. All of them are success. You're the magician. It's just that you need to also choose what exactly you want in the realms of love. Angels, spirit guides, love yourself. First, it says your self-respect makes you more what you like, Aquarius, to know for the week of the 22nd of March, 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 22nd of March. So I think be, look forward to a promotion Look forward to building your security back up. There's one here. Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. Angels are so nice. Look at that. I'm 
I am here still shuffling, so I'll do one more. Aquarius, Aquarius, what would you like Aquarius to know? What would you like Aquarius to know? Aquarius, Aquarius. Free yourself. It's time to take back control of your life. Yes. 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 I think you 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 want to expand and do other things. Angels and spirit guides, what would you like Aquarius to know? I am leading you toward the pr to answer to your prayers. Please listen to and follow the steps I'm communicating through your intuition, thoughts and dreams. Angel spirit guides. Life review. Take inventory of your life and resolve to change or heal anything that is unbalanced. And new romance is imminent either with a newcomer or through reignited passion in your existing relationship. Be open to giving and receiving love. And this is what it says. Be, keep an open mind. I knew I saw the word open. Keep your options open, Aquarius. You've, this security is not bringing you happiness. It's, help, it's fighting. It's worry. This money has not brought happiness if it's within the marriage or the someone's got your back is coming to fight for you there's other things that you need to do take a path make it a success and be open to new romance and or or reignited passion you can make anything a success I've been the gift Susie. Please like, subscribe and share and I'll see you soon and listen to the I'll do the 48 hours tomorrow and speak to you soon. Bye bye.